The ethos of judo is respect, having respect of your elders, your younger people, and really learning to live with the pressures of being disappointed and winning and having things go your way and maybe not go your way some days. It's a way of life. Well, I got started with a gentleman that ran a fish and chip shop. I was small for my age and it gave me confidence, not to be aggressive, but to understand the environment I was in and knowing when and not to be in certain places. From the age of five to eight, it's all about interaction, the core elements, the flexibility, coordination, and having fun and training with fun and not realizing. Not much competition, but a challenge in the fun way. And then they go to eight to 15, and then they start getting their belts. And from there, if they're willing to train hard enough, they go into competitions. To be able to teach five-year-olds, eight-year-olds upwards and see them progress, I can't wish for anything more. See, Jack, I believe in an oral. See about the win, the one win, on doing some Atlantic core stripped in. Between half a grenade judo, Achus, my oil, and my energetic. I doing grenade rugby, heavy. I can help you rugby. How can I do my only tackle or throw in? My doing Gribble City Glanyon Yow. I my Hudder Ready Dordam line. We're very fortunate. We've had success at the Manchester Commonwealth Games with Gary Coles, and also recently with Natalie Powell and Kirsty, her sister. Natalie is now ranked ninth in the world, so from Mid Wales in a little club, it's nice to see them develop. And she came back 48 hours after winning in Glasgow at the Commonwealth Games to show all her children here that she knew where she started from. Yeah. Whilst I like to see Olympic medalists and top people, the, the grounding for all children at the age of five upward must be this discipline and respect, especially if they come to my club. Yeah.